morning on YouTube. I am at the Gibson Trailhead. I'm going to hike up to uh, Lake of the Clouds. Uh, there are three alpine lakes up there. It's uh, mid-May. Uh, we've had an average snowfall this year. So uh, what I'm hoping to do is get up to those alpine lakes and um, hopefully they're an ice off and I can fly fish them. So uh, we'll see. I read a trail report last week that uh, that there's some snow up there, but there was no update on the conditions of the lake. All right, I'm on the Rainbow Trail, which is a feeder trail to the Lake of the Clouds Trail. Down below me is the valley. Uh, you can see the cities of West Cliff and Silver Cliff. In the mountains to the east, those are the wet mountains. And we are in the Sangre de Cristo Mountains that we're hiking up okay. today. We've reached the trail intersection of Rainbow Trail and the Swift Creek Trail. You can head down another mile to the Lake of the Clouds Trail along the Rainbow Trail. Uh, I think we'll go up, Tiva and I, I think we'll go up the uh, Swift Creek Trail. My understanding is it's a little rocky, a little bit steeper, steeper but uh, 3.7 miles to the lakes. All right. I am uh, 1.73 miles in, and uh, the trail has flattened out a little bit. Uh, coming up, uh, we ran into a turkey, uh, so that was interesting. Tiva scared it, obviously, and it uh, it uh, flew up into a tree and then flew back down a mountainside. So, um, trail so far has been pretty good conditions. All right, 2.33 miles in. This is the crossing of Swift Creek. Gonna try and uh, not get wet. It's about ankle deep. 3.84 miles in, <clears throat> 1,700 of the feet of elevation gain, and uh, hit some snow packs here. So, already crossed one. Uh, there's several more ahead of me. Uh, each snow field is maybe 10 feet across the trail. already been a lot of people through it so uh it's already been uh trailed out if you will so. spread eagle peak behind us or in front of us i should say beautiful lake we're gonna try and uh put the fly rod in here and see if we have any trout Done with Lake of the Clouds. It's about a nine mile round trip hike. Uh, very rocky, very rooted. Uh, again, about 2,500 foot of elevation gain, vertical elevation gain. Uh, the fishing was phenomenal. Uh, there were some snow fields up at the top, a uh, little bit of post holing, but um, uh, not, nothing too bad. Uh, it was pretty much snow free. A couple areas where you had to tra traverse some snow fields. Um, but on the west end of the lake, uh, tons of greenback cutthroats, uh, and they were eager to eat. Uh, it was a great day fly fishing, great day hiking.